Hello, in this video, we're going to see how to use the consult prompt. What I mean, you may want to consult about an opinion or an argument as someone else, like for example, as Elon Musk or as Bill Gates mm -hmm. or as anybody else, okay? So we're going to look at how you can, what prompt, chat GDP prompt you can use to have to criticize a topic at someone else, okay? Something like that to consult, all right? So we're going to go to chat, chat.openi.com, all right? Uh, for those who are not uh, logged in, you have to first sign up. But let me assume you went to chat GDP and you have an account. So you can start by giving it a prompt. I'm going to give it a prompt. I already copied, so I just pasted saying, I'll provide you with an argument of mine. I want to. I want you to criticize it as if you were Elon Musk. So here you can change the name to anything, to maybe whatever you want. Okay, depending on the on the subject that you want to consult, or as uh, anybody. So for me, I'm going to leave it to Elon Musk. Okay, so I'm going to say send. And uh, GDP will get, tell you like, sure, go ahead and present your argument. I will do my best, blah, blah, blah. To criticize as if I were Elon Musk. Remember, this is the uh, meant to be constructive and challenging, okay? So I'm going to kind of ask, uh, I'm going to put my opinion, or oh, it's an argument, whatever it is. So let me say, uh, let me copy something here. Uh, so let me paste this. Metaverse will be worth 10 millions by 2030. Okay. So this is my opinion. So I want it to be criticized as if I was Elon Musk. So let me send this. Okay. Charlie P will kind of actually reply, well, I understand that a lot, but sensational, you know, something like that. It's kind of cool. So with ChatGDP, you can try to criticize the subject as if you are that person. You can even criticize uh, a topic as if you are maybe a president. You know, something like that. It's kind of cool. If you read, if you read, really look, uh, read into it, you see it's kind of genuine and makes sense. Okay. So let's try it for maybe. Um, let's give it another challenge. Uh, let me copy something here. Um, remember when you when you construct a, a prompt at the beginning, it's stored, so you don't have to kind of redo this. You don't have to command it again. You don't have to rewrite this prompt, and this maybe you're going to change, uh, maybe the person. But if you're still on this first prompt, um, for Chat GDP to criticize your argument as Elon Musk, so you, you just declare it once. So here I just put another opinion. I don't have to actually retype this the first prompt. So I want ChatGDP to have, uh, to, uh, to criticize about this opinion. Paper stocks will, will skyrocket by 2030, all right? So let me just send and uh, where are I know. So ChatGDP will kind of criticize uh, this opinion as Elon Musk, you know, it's kind of cool. Uh, it's better if it's it's important to kind of criticize a subject using a person in that same sector. For example, if you bring in, uh, it's better if you bring in Elon Musk in AI and you know, technology topics. It will be uh, a bit off topic to bring Elon Musk maybe in uh, agriculture, you know. So if it's politics, it's better if you bring in someone who is in that sector, all right? So that is a prompt that you can use to consult about a topic as someone else, all right? It's simple. You just go to your chat GDP and write, I'll provide you with an argument of mine. I want you to criticize it as if you were 
then you put in there. And that is it. Thank you for watching this video. Bye-bye.